Uh, there is a uh, key expansion or call it scheduling. Uh, you can see that sometimes we have 10 rounds, sometimes we have 12 rounds, sometimes we have 14 rounds. Okay, and when you uh, input the key, you will have a matrix that contains 16 bytes. 16 bytes mean what? 128 bits. It looks like uh, this matrix here. Okay, so this is the initial matrix. Okay, this is the original key. Now, um, this key is going to be used what is going to be used to in the initial round when we do the XOR with the key with the with the text in the initial round but after that when we start the um, the first round okay we need to generate a new key from this uh, you know starting key uh, and every round we need to have a new key a new key so we need to do what we need to do what we call it what uh, expansion expansion is basically is somehow to get more words from the original key in order to be enough for what for the whole round so how do we do that it's a very this is the original key actually this is the let's write here original key how do I, this is word zero okay this is word zero as you can see word zero this is word one and this is word two and this is word what three it's written right here so in order to generate the key for the second round, okay, uh, if I go back here, you can see that this is the this is the first key, okay, this is the first key in the initial round, this is the initial round. Now you can see that the second when you start the round, we have a different key. How do we generate this from this key, okay? Uh, let's see how we do that. Uh, we take each word separately. And then these words will goes into what will goes into the G algorithm. The G algorithm do some uh, steps. These steps include rotate, S box, and XOR. Okay, rotate, S box, and XOR. Now the first bit, the first word is has a special treatment. The first word you has to do what you has to do the whole thing. Rotate okay and s box okay and also what x o okay um now for example uh, i gave you an example but it's not exactly what happened i just let you understand uh, you know the main concept okay so the first word will have special treatment because now uh, the first word will have special treatment with rotate s box and x o XOR with what? XOR with a constant number. This constant number is basically a count, uh, depends on the number of rounds. So in the first round, you XOR it with one. In the second round, you XOR it with two. The third round with four. Until the tenth round, you XOR it with what? With 36. And you can see that in the ninth round, you XOR it with what? With 1B. So these numbers are what? Are not a decimal number. They are hexadecimal number they are what hexadecimal number so uh, in order to do that let's uh, you know go back to the uh, you know the excel for example and uh, do this operation okay let's take the first word word zero okay let's take it without the word i'm gonna have to copy it okay copy that and i'll put it right here so the first thing i need to do rotate rotate is basically just do a shift a shift will be done in a vertical way so this will be done like this i have to shift that by one shift uh it's just a black box let's do it with one shift okay so i'm gonna do it one shift by putting like this and the b will be what copy the b will be at the end to b okay so these two are just moved as as i can see that okay i'm just gonna put them back so you can see them so i did what i did the shift now uh, after i did the shift you can see this is now the rotate we call it what rotate after the rotate we have to do what the s box again okay i have to do the s box the s box similar to so we have seven e where is the seven the seven will be here okay and the e is gonna be the last one so this one will be what would be f three okay 15 is one five so the one and five 
is 599 and you continue doing that so 16 is 16 which is 47 okay 47 and the last one is 2b 2b is 2 and b is f1 so that one be f1 uh, correct me if i'm wrong so this one is what is the s box okay we just did it uh, the same way that we did uh, the, uh, the the encryption before and the last one is the XOR XOR with this so this is the first round I'm gonna XOR it with what I'm gonna XOR it with the numbers right here so the first round I'm gonna XOR it with zero one so I have to XOR each one with what with zero one it's very simple and easy way to do that okay so what do you do actually okay let's take the first one is up to three F3 is equal to what? F3 is equal to what? Is equal to um, F is 1, 1, 1, 1, and the 3 is what? 0, 0, 1, 1. And uh, take the 0, 1. The 0, 1 is what? Is actually, I'm um, going to make this one is general. Okay, general or number. Okay, and remove the digit because we didn't need the digit the zero one is actually zero one is actually zero 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 and then if we have what we have the one the one is zero 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 one so i have to explore this with the together the output will be what the output basically will be one 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 and then zero zero one zero so what's the output here the output will be f2 so here we will have what for example f2 and you do the same for the other one okay this one will produce what will produce word number four okay so this one will produce number word number four here okay uh, if you continue this way okay so uh, we will have, for example, uh, these numbers. So for word four, we will have this number. This is word four. So word four become this one here. How do I get word five? Okay. Now go back to the algorithm. This is the first word. The first word will have to go through us these three operation. All right but the second one is not going to have this operation the second one is simply getting word one and xor it with what and xor it with the word four so the output from word one will xor it with word one uh, one sorry and to get the word five so how we do that i'll give you an example okay very simple okay i'll take this one okay i'll take this one word for copy this is word for okay and xor it with what and xor with what with word one this one here and xor it with word one this one this will give us word five here that will give us word five this one here okay and how do we get word six word six is equal to what word six is equal to what is equal to word five xor with what xor with word two and how we get word seven word seven is equal to what is equal to uh word six xor with what xor with word three and so we get word five four five six seven this is key number zero we can call it key number zero for example okay and then how do we get key number two the second key which is key number uh, key one how do we get key one same way Okay, the same way. We take the first bit, the first word, and for the first word, we have to do these three operations. 
but for the second one okay we have to what uh, we have to XOR it with the previous previous one this is a very simple way to do that so this is how exactly happened you can see from the diagram word one is a good special treatment but word two a uh, word five is getting from uh, word one XOR with what with word four so this one is equal to word four XOR with what XOR with word one very simple and word six is equal to what is equal to word five XOR with word two from the original matrix and so on all right okay clear now this is the normal way but in 256 bit okay in 256 bit we have what we have 14 round we have But they have add an extra step in the middle okay they have add actually what they have actually add the sub word the sub word and so rotate word uh, perform one by circular shift that we did and the sub word perform by substitution in each byte of its input word using the s box we did that and the result of the step one and two is XORed with the round constant, which is this one. Because we have 14 rounds, so we need to do that. I think I implement all these things to you. Now, this is the whole picture for the algorithm. AS algorithm, which is the plain text encryption and the decryption uh, while the key is expanded. So in the first one, we use for zero to three uh, words. Second key is four to seven word and, and so on.